Hi guys. Today, in 2021, most cameras have in-body stabilizations. Most new cameras have in-body stabilizations. And a lot of lenses also have that. So the question is, gimbals, do you really need them anymore? I'm gonna go out on a limb and say, yes, absolutely you need a gimbal if you're doing video, especially if you're a one-man show like me, your gimbal is gonna be a lifesaver. For one thing, the camera stabilization, it can be a little wobbly. You know, you can see it around the edges, it can be a little wobbly. I don't like that. And uh, I also find the movement, the, uh, the, the movement a gimbal gives, for me, it looks better than in-body stabilization. And, and here's the thing, a, a gimbal is so much more than a stabilizer. But often I see people using it basically as a tripod, only using the stabilizing quality of the gimbal. At most, they are working with the gimbal at eye level. Now, there's nothing wrong with that per se, but it's so much more you can do with a gimbal if you're just doing that. You're not using the tool. So let me show you a few examples where a gimbal comes in handy. This is a parallax movement where I'm really doing three camera movements at one time. I'm arching down, I'm pushing forward, and I'm tilting the camera up. Doing this without a gimbal would be extremely difficult. It's, it's difficult enough to do it with a gimbal. Here, I'm pushing back and zooming in. Previously, before gimbals, you would need a dolly and a focus puller to achieve this shot. But if you have a gimbal and a camera with autofocus, you can, you can pull this up. And for special things like, you know, when you're holding the gimbal with one hand, riding a bike, skateboarding, some, you know, you need your extra hand free. Stuff like this would be extremely difficult to do if you don't have a gimbal. And let's say you need to change camera operators in mid shot, like here. A gimbal is a great solution. And there is so much more you can do. This is just top of the iceberg of what you can do with a gimbal, what you couldn't do without it basically, or, or having a variety of other stuff where you constantly have to change uh, uh, the camera, putting it from a slider on a jib or on a tripod. You, you have a gimbal and you're ready to go for everything. And that means you can work extremely fast. So like, like this uh, uh, gun and run situations, which most of my work persists on when I'm out on the field. So I need to, I need to work fast. Often I have people waiting for me. So, so complex setup is, is not an option. So for anybody who is making video, I would say gimbal is something you should invest in right after you got the camera and your lens.